what is going on guys Carl back again with another brilliant adventure so if you watched the first video in this paper mill we are back uh, back with Matt here hey guys. it's a scouting because this was actually the position or the place where we got to and then we saw two people so we had to put the peg at so as promised we come back for a part two hopefully we can get a bit further it's a bit later in the day so hopefully and it's a bank holiday Monday so hopefully there is no one here but us we're hoping you see anyone? So fire's no one around. Oh, cool. Still be quiet and quick. Yeah, we do have to still be quiet just in case, but we didn't see the car that was parked outside last time, so a bit of luck. It's just us. But we did realise that maybe some other people would actually come here to maybe explore or do whatever they needed to do. Because the gate that we came in was slightly open. We did explore, that's the building we explored last time. But now we're moving in, as you can see, guys. Is massive, and hopefully, my camera don't die this time because I didn't bring a spare battery. Right. What's in there? Huh? Another little one there, guys. I think, I think that this bit leads up to the office, isn't it? Stairs are pretty cool. God, it's all creepy fucking cold. Oh god. Oh god. God, this not even like this is pretty scary. How I'm gonna do a haunted video? How I'm gonna do a haunted video? I don't know. <laughs> One's wireless now. Come a long way. God, this bit's the worst bit I've ever seen. Goodness. So there's one more room down. God. It's literally just me and Matt here. So if you hear any other noises other than us, then this place is most definitely haunted. Some stairs, some stairs go up there. We're going to check where it's starting when they go on. Bloody good chops. <laughs> I think, is that a piano? Or is that just some cupboards? Yeah, it's just some cupboards. Fire extinguisher on top. Guys, still got the blinds in the windows if you have a look. The blinds are actually still in the windows, which is pretty, pretty creepy. So I'm supposed to put some paint on the floor. Obviously, give up on the decorating. Right? <laughs> right, I'm going to stairs. Right, guys, we're going to go back through. I'm going to go up the stairs and I'm going to check out one floor of this building. Not the whole building because it's absolutely massive. Oh, God. I was desperate for a shit. I had to go through the wall. Oh, God. Stairs are here, guys. All the way. See if we can get out here. I don't really fucking trust this floor. Guys, 
like the sort of thing we're looking at. Random seat on the side over there, pretty scary. That's a lot of rubble in there. Yeah. Yeah guys, we wanna we wanna try and get as much as this explored as possible just for you guys. We ain't we ain't hundred percent sure how many people have actually been here before us, but it's obviously been, it's been very burnt here. See, very burnt. We're just gonna come to this little hut here. Oh, guys, the ceiling is gone. Try to keep. There's been a fire in here. Someone set fire to the building. Right. Let's see what's up these stairs. Probably nothing. No, look how bad this. This has been badly burnt, guys. Badly burnt. This used to be a room. The roof got burnt down. Got completely burnt down. It's unreal. I don't really trust being on this floor. It's so overgrown here. It's not really about. Clear? Oh, look at that, guys. Look at this wood. Ugh. We have said that we do need to start wearing gloves. Someone commented on my last video, my restaurant video, to say that uh, I do need to start wearing gloves just to be on the safe side. You never know what you're going to find in these sort of places. Right down the stairs. Yeah, that did sound like there was someone talking, didn't it? As far as we're aware of, as far as we are aware, we are the only people here, but it did sound like there was some talking coming from the building that we literally just looked in there, so we want to hope there's no one there. Back that way. God, we just said if we do get spotted again, we're going to run exactly the same way that we ran out last time. I really don't want to bring you a part three. Yeah. Yeah, around here. There is like a, a little fence. I think so. Hopefully, it's just us two guys. Because, like I just said, a part three. I don't want to do a part three for you guys. Oh, there used to be a roof here. Wait a minute. Can get one? Can get my Bad drills. Get my torch out. Let's go to the dark one first. There's, there's some wire like coming right through the, the building here. Loads of pipes in there. This used to be. Just go straight up. More than one there. I don't think it just found or vandalised me. I think they're bad. I think it's the foundation of birds in the family. Oh god, what is this? Guys, if anyone from Ipswich or Suffolk watches this, which I'm sure a few friends on my Facebook channel will, or my Facebook page will, you need to let me know what this, like, what this was actually used for because I'm not sure. All I know is it's a paper mill. That's it. But, oh God, this doesn't look good. It's green. Man, these puddles are green. 
That's not good. I will, I will try and leave this like, as unedited as possible because I want to get you to see as much as I'm seeing. I need to keep on looking behind me just in case. Not in there. An iron board. An old iron board. There's some hope there. Doing another fire in here. That scared the hell out of me, man. There's an old safe there. Let's see what's in there. Nothing. Nothing at all. I'm finding loads of car parts as well. What's that? That looks like a fridge. That's an old fridge. A mini one. Let's get this bit out. Old little stats. Not a lot in there, guys. Looks like they've been doing some work. Of course, no idea what that was. People using it as a tip, I think. That was the actual main bit that I wouldn't mind getting into at the moment. We're just in a garage. Here yeah, guys, you've got to remember this wood, this wood on these buildings here has been here since 1847. So it's, it's near, well, not nearly, but it's... At the moment, trying to find a way, it might be a little bit impossible in here. Yeah. Would be good to get in there. Plus, uh, Oh, what's that? That's a little dumping shaft. Mm. So, fire extinguisher. Another fire extinguisher over there. Mm. It's going to be harder. I think it's mud. Got caked in mud, guys. If you like these sort of videos, guys, then please hit the subscribe button because there's going to be a lot more of this sort of content coming out because me and, me and Matt really enjoy doing it. It's, it's a good buzz, you get a good buzz off it and if you're thinking about doing urban exploring yourself then I highly recommend doing it, Just find the right places and try not to get caught because if you get caught obviously there are some serious consequences you know stairs, is it? yeah there's the stairs that go up to there oh, I'm going to get another guy there is literally just so open over here and so deserted hopefully that's looking good over there, it's a massive door Hopefully it's not been boarded up. No, but every, every window, mate, massive window. Oh, every window's been smashed out. Uh, even the fence has been boarded up. But then again... Oh, I might be able to... Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, what's that? Bit dark. Oh, God, that's scary. Bit of glass up there moving. That's good, hell of Right, we'll have a look in here. Let's see what's wrong. There's a lot of graffiti in here. A lot. Hang on, I'll go in there in a minute. Hang on. The little rooms, everything's been demolished. But there's been a lot of people coming here. A lot of people. Because like, a graffiti is pretty good. Let me go. And hopefully it's haunted. We do want to start doing ex uh, haunted exploring because I watch a YouTuber who's really good at it and it looks quality. Yeah. There's literally glass everywhere, guys. Also, guys, we do want to head around the country. Whoever watches this, if you've got any, any heads up about where we should actually explore around the country, there's a, there's a nice little list on online which looks okay. And I, there's a nice little list online that looks okay, so we're going to hit some of these up, like Birmingham and places like that, so... What's in there? Oh, wow. Oh, that sort of stuff. Oh, there's some fridges in here. Right, we'll see if we can... Is it? Okay, 
those little fridges. Loads of mattresses, isn't it? This looks this look like a bathroom. Loads of matches holding the ceiling there where someone would probably fell through. Okay, this used to be a washroom and a bathroom. What old that is. Sink. Hard hat. Didn't know this guy had been. Maybe not. An old bathroom. I think that's the garage coming through. What's in there? No. I'm not going to lie, guys, that was pretty scary. <laughs> that was pretty scary because obviously I didn't know there could have been anyone in there hiding, just waiting out for someone to come in. Yeah, that was good. That was a good buzzer like that. Right. So guys, here's the slide I was talking about. It's not obviously just the slide, it's like a I don't know, a little shoot to get rid of get some stuff that goes with some bones there. From a rat or a mouse or something. Guys, this place is actually massive. It's actually huge. Okay, there's still a lot. It's just like mainly rubbish and graffiti cans and snow cans and bottles. I don't know what this used to be. It's like a little bed with some Asian writing. If you're watching this and you're from Asia, to please tell me what that says. Thank you. Guys, I could explore this place for hours, I think, but I'm not sure I would want to do it. Oh, it's just, just some random sink. Some random sink. Nice. Oh, God, it really stinks out of your guys. Oh no. Just got loads of loads of sewage just out the outside bit. Right. But we're still on the outside. There's no point going back through the way we just came. We just right guys we're gonna have to quickly quickly find this bit because the road is literally just there. We get caught there. That's it, mission over. Oh I cannot believe that. I'm not sure if you saw that, but literally just dropped my phone. <laughs> Could not believe that. Yeah, it's still good. It's still good. Mate, this place is cursed because last time we came here, I dropped my phone. I dropped my phone twice, so I've only been there twice. Right. Guys, I think, I think we're going to leave it there. Because, I don't know, it's getting, it's getting a bit late. We don't know the security rotation. There could be anyone coming back anytime soon. And ideally, we want to get out of here as best in possible, uh, in best time, just in case. <coughs> Alright guys, if you enjoyed the video, if you want a part three where we come round and we'll, we'll explore maybe the other side of this building, exactly the same building, it's going to be exactly the same layout, but I think that's the one where the skate ramp is. If you want a part three, then let me know in the comment section below. And then I'll give you a part three. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you want more of this sort of content. And also, if you want to see Matt's beautiful face a bit more. Always, yeah. So, why wouldn't Never you? Never So, if you enjoyed the video, guys, give it a thumbs up. And also, any feedback like on my videos, maybe what I should do different. Like, maybe if we should start looking at haunted places. If there's anything, just fill that comment section up. That's what it's there for. And please, subscribe. That's the most important thing. 
if I could get, I'd be happy with 200 views. I know, like, obviously, if you just viewed it, like, 200 views would be really cool. My last video got is on 182 at the moment, so it's getting there. I'm starting to get a bit seen. But yeah, peace, guys. Have a good day. Guys, like, share everything with all your mates. Let's get as much views as we can. Come on, see you later, guys.